the regulation will uh, give the users some rights. Uh, we will regulate the platforms, the online platforms, in a way that uh, you know creates some fundamental rules. So, uh, if you are taken down because of something you say, uh, then you have a right to complain, uh, and you you have a right to, to to know what will happen. We will make sure that there will be complaint systems in place. So, <clears throat> in many ways, the users of the platforms, no matter whether it is a a business or it's a person uh, will have more rights. So in that respect, it is a higher level of protection. In the offline world, in, in, uh, in shops, uh, they, uh, the shop owner is responsible for uh, what is sold in his shop. Uh, and of course, he could go to the manufacturer and, and the importer, but he's responsible for the fact that the product needs to be safe. Online, the platforms, they don't have that kind of responsibility. And I think that we have to look into how we create a bigger uh, level of uh, safety for products online, sold online. And the proposal is doing things. It is, for instance, uh, putting an obligation to the platforms to know who the sellers are. But what if you can't find them? Uh, who should then have the responsibility? And here I think we should look into whether the platforms should have that responsibility, a kind of a an importer responsibility, but it's still early days and we still look, have to look into it. But I think that we're not doing enough for uh, making sure that we have safe products also sold online. Well, it is important for us that we uh, regulate the platforms because they play such a big role in our society. So they have become kind of uh, uh, social uh, public spaces. And therefore it is, it is important to make sure that, we, that they are transparent. What are they doing? Uh, how are they moderating content, for instance? How are they regulating uh, on the platforms uh, the way they, they do the things? We want them to be transparent. Transparent on, on the obligations uh, for, and the transparent on, on, uh, on the content moderation etc. So we want more transparency because with transparency it's easy to get, to get, you know, to know where you are as a user, as a business user and as a person. So we, we believe that that is important but we also think that the pro proposal is a good step in that direction. Well, in many ways uh, we very often do things in Europe that create a kind of golden standard globally. We know that since we are such a big market that it has an impact on the global trade or the global standards. We did it with the GDPR, the data protection regulation and the standards there. Now that has become the golden standard for many countries. They look into how can they uh, copy paste or at least learn from us. I think that the regulation of the online uh, platforms should be the same, that we create you know, a kind of a golden standard. We want transparency, we want accountability, we want better protection, uh, and we want democratic control. And that, is, uh, that, that could be the golden standard for the world. So I think it will have a positive impact, hopefully. And maybe the US-based uh, companies, they, some of them think it is a good idea and others are a little bit more skeptical. But I mean, it's a fact of life. We have a market with more than 450 million citizens. So of course we have a right also to, to control that market. I think one of the loopholes uh, seen from my perspective is uh, the lack of um, uh, consumer protection when it, when it comes to dangerous products and I, therefore I would like also to see consumer protection be a part of the scope of the regulation and maybe giving the platforms a bit more responsibility to check uh, the sellers before they are uh, uh, coming online and selling their products. So I think there are still some loopholes. However, it is early days uh, and we are still in the beginning of the process here in the Parliament, so we will probably find more loopholes and more things to, to, to try to address later on. But it is important to, to start the work and we have started it now and I'm really looking forward to, to work with this.